Good morning guys. Today is Monday. The start of a fresh new week. And I'm trying to think of something to say. <laughs> I have nothing. I'm just getting ready to do my morning routine. I do have to stop and put gas in my car because I was supposed to do that over the weekend and I forgot and it just dawned on me a little bit ago so uh, but that doesn't take much extra time in the mornings but anyway I think that's it I'm trying to think I think that's it for now but I will talk to you again soon I just fed them Oh, somebody noticed. Good morning, guys. Today is Tuesday, and I'm just doing my normal morning routine. Getting ready to head out the door, start another day, hope for another good one. And, um,. I think that's it for now. I can't think of anything else to say, but I will talk to you again soon. Having a thunderstorm right now. Good morning. Today is Wednesday, so halfway through the week. And I'm running kind of late this morning. I really don't know why. I don't feel like I took more time than any other day, but I'm running late, so I need to get my butt in gear. So I will talk to you again soon. So I'm walking around Target. The whole reason I wanted to come here was for this, this bat garland that I saw on YouTube that was at Target's dollar spot. I think this is actually three dollars and I'm so glad I came here because I got the last one yeah three dollars but I picked this up I'm gonna go back up there and look around one more time before I leave this which is also three dollars there and look around a little bit more. I went back up there but I didn't pick anything else up. I really wanted those though. So I'm glad they had at least one. Well I'm done in Target. I don't know if you can see this any better out here. They're little bats, their little wings and their little iridescent eyes. And who did I see show this? I don't remember. I've watched a lot of different YouTube videos that were showing like Target's dollar spot. And I didn't need anything Halloween, as you know. Oh my goodness, I just noticed their little ears. I don't know if you can see the little ears. I wish they would have had two of these. I would have bought two. But that was the whole reason I went to Target was for those. And at first I got disappointed because where those were hanging, they had pumpkins and ghosts. and. I was like, oh man, my Target doesn't have the bats. And then I went around the corner and there was one just laying there. Like somebody was gonna get it and change their mind or maybe they didn't have enough room. But that was the only one they had. But at least I got one, you know, so that's awesome. And so now I'm headed over across the street to Panera because I'm gonna have Panera for dinner. My husband, he had like bids that were kind of late in the day, so he's just going to go straight to pool. It's Wednesday, so he goes and plays pool with some friends and a cousin. And then my oldest and his friend that are here visiting, they're going to go out to eat because um, she leaves tomorrow morning. So I'm going to have the house to myself for a little while this evening. And so I just decided to place a to-go order at Panera. Um, I love Panera and they have an app so you can use the app 
to place an order and then you just go in and you pay on the app and everything so then you just go in and they have like this spot that you go pick your bag up and we tried it once and it worked out really good and everything so um, I'm trying I'm not trying I'm actually going to do it myself today last time my husband went and picked it up you even tell them what time you want to pick it up and everything so now I'm gonna drive over to Panera I'm gonna have a half of a Fuji apple chicken salad that is my favorite salad they do and a bowl of black bean soup I love their black bean soup I like a lot of their soups that's one of my favorites though and it's lower calorie and it's got a ton of fiber and it's really healthy and it's very very filling so cuz I'm still doing really good on my healthy eating plan I also did I get I did look all around I'm sitting at a light right now I did look all around Target they don't have any other Halloween stuff out yet besides just at the dollar spot um, they had a lot of fall stuff there too, but I don't need any fall stuff. So I was tempted by a few things, but I didn't buy anything. And they still have all their school supplies out. So I think when that gets cleared out is when they'll get the Halloween out. And really it's, is it just me or does it feel like they're getting Halloween out a little earlier this year? I mean, I love Halloween and everything, but I mean it's not even fall yet <laughs> so but of course if they had Halloween I would certainly be looking at it and you know my husband and I went into sp the spirit Halloween store and if there's Halloween I'm definitely gonna take advantage of looking at it because I love looking at that stuff my mom's like that with Christmas stuff and I'm like that with Halloween I like looking at Christmas stuff too but Halloween is just my favorite they always come out with such creative things and I've been seeing YouTube videos on that kind of stuff too and I like to watch it you know when people do like little tours and hauls and stuff of the things they buy that's fun and so now I'm pulling up Panera also has a drive-thru so I could have done the drive-thru I suppose but I don't know oh, I'll just go ahead and go in pick up my stuff, head home, have my dinner, probably just watch TV. <laughs> I don't know what else. Or actually, I'll probably watch YouTube. See if there's any videos I need to get caught up on or anything. We'll see. But anyway, I'm going to go in and pick my stuff up and then head home. But that's it for now. There is a Ghost Brothers Marathon on Destination America, and I am in a happy place right now. I love this show so much. I really want them to bring it back. Good morning, guys. Today is Thursday, so like I always say, last day of the week I have to drive down to the building since I work home on Fridays. And, or work from home on Fridays and then yesterday in a meeting my boss was like it's a three-day weekend leave however early as you can on Friday so I'm gonna look and see what meetings I have on to tomorrow and then uh, leave early tomorrow so that's pretty awesome um, I love when she does that it's just really nice you know but anyway I'm just getting my stuff together and getting ready to head out the door. Um, my oldest is already gone. I think um, his friend's flight leaves at 5.45 in the morning, so they were getting up to the airport really early, and the airport's close to an hour away from our house, so um, I'm gonna be kind of worried until I know that they're home safe. So anyway, that's it for this morning. I'm gonna just get headed at the door and quit hemming and hawing and I will talk to you again soon. Hey guys, it is Friday, about five minutes after 11. I didn't waste any time. <laughs> Meeting got over a few minutes early. I think I told you guys yesterday my boss said that to leave as early as we could today and enjoy the three-day weekend and so the only obligation I had today was a meeting that was at 10 
I was supposed to be from 10 to 11, got out a little bit early. So I logged off at about 5 to 11. And now I am headed out to that area where the bigger target is because I want to check there to see if, if that target has another one of those bat garlands in their dollar spot. And then there's also a big lots out there and I don't remember, I think it was on YouTube. You know how you have like your subscriptions, like the people you're subscribed to, but then it also recommends channels for you. Or there was a channel they recommended or a video they recommended that was like Big Lots Halloween. And it was somebody showing the stuff that Big Lots had for Halloween. And they had this, it looks like books, but it's, a decoration and then the books like wiggle and like tilt out and stuff it's like just this little display and so there's a big lots out here so I figured I would look in there and see if my big lots has their Halloween stuff and if they do I'll look at it and I say this every time I don't need any Halloween stuff I have enough but sometimes you know you like to refresh it a little bit and um, so yeah, I really need to get up into the attic and go through all of the Halloween and holiday stuff for that matter. And what I would like to do, because I don't even get the stuff down out of the attic anymore, for the last few years, instead of storing my Halloween stuff in the attic, I store it where our washer and dryer is. There's like some shelving in there. And so I don't even remember what all I have up in the attic. But I think my mom had mentioned one time if I ever went through that stuff. So I'm thinking, you know, if I get the chance to go through there, maybe I could find some stuff to give to my mom. Um, I don't know. Because I don't really remember what all's up there. Might not be anything that's really any good since I've been saving the stuff in the laundry room. I call it the room, but it's not. It's basically a closet. But, um, and then that's also this where I'm going is where the Spirit Halloween store that, I, that Brian and I went to already last weekend. So I'm not going to go in there again. But Michael's is out here, so I might go in Michael's just to look around. Um, my main goal is I want to go to Big Lots and see if it, they have their Halloween stuff and those books. And then see if Target has any of that bat garland. Because I would really like to have another one of those. And then maybe just see what I'm going to see out there. I don't really... I just didn't want to stay in the house for the rest of the day. I thought, you know, if my boss has given us this time, I wanted to enjoy it. I would have preferred to do something with my husband. But he has a few fence bids that he's going to be doing. One of them is like 75 miles away. And so he has it scheduled where he's going all the way the, to the one that's 75 miles away. And then the other ones are like on his way back. So he's like, it doesn't feel so bad because instead of just, you know, one way 75 and back 75, he's getting some more bids on the way home. So that's just the way it happens sometimes because their range only goes out so far. Every once in a while he'll get somebody wanting to do a bid that's like, you know, 300 miles away and he has to call and say, no, the store sent this to the wrong uh, lead system. So, but anyway, that's what I'm up to tomorrow. I think we're just going to go to Oceans of Fun, so I might end up ending this vlog today because if all we do is go to Oceans of Fun, there really won't be anything to vlog about tomorrow, and like I said, today I got off early, so I'm going to go do my shopping around today, and Sunday my husband and I might do something, I don't know, but if we do anything interesting, I'll just start the, the next week's vlog on Sunday like I do sometimes and I think that's
that's it for now, but I will share with you if I find those books at uh, Big Lots and if I see any fun stuff, I'll share it with you. So I'll talk to you again soon. Skeleton bats. cool that I have a haunted TV already. It's different than this one, but this is cool. Is it working? fall stuff and I think this is a really pretty color scheme. You know it's different. Just really pretty. Okay, I'm done with Big Lots and Target, or not Target, Michaels, that's right back there. I did not end up getting those books. I didn't get anything at Big Lots because once I saw the books in person, they're, they're $20, and they're probably worth $20, but they just seemed, I don't know, they, they didn't seem as nice in person, if that makes sense, so I did not get them. I did, however, get two things from Michaels. They always have the coolest Halloween stuff. Um, I got this. I love how it looks old-fashioned. It says Black Cat Brand Cauldron Polish. This was the last one. It's got like a I got this, I think I'm gonna put it in the kitchen. Like in my little kitchen window, there's a little ledge. So I got that, and then I got one more thing. I got this, where it just says trick or treat with the black cat arching its back. I really liked the old fashioned look of it too. 
I wish they would have had more designs, but, and then I just, you know, I just looked at everything else because they always have cool stuff. But that's all I got at Michael's. I did, I did go over and, you know, looked at the yarn for the heck of it, and they didn't have anything on sale. They had a few um, clearance things, but nothing that I really felt like I needed. So I think I'm going, because the only other thing on this side of the street is that Spirit Halloween, which we just went to last weekend, and they didn't have everything out yet, but they had enough out. And then there's a liquor store, <laughs> you know, besides just the place I just, so yeah, the spirit, oh, and then there's some like food places down there. So I'm going to go over to the other side of the street and they have a Dollar Tree over there. I think I might go in there again because you know how Dollar Tree is, though, like they had some Halloween stuff and then, you know, a week or two later they'll have more. And so I'm gonna look over there. I really don't even know why I'm looking at Halloween stuff. It's just, you know, some things just make you feel good. That's the way, way Halloween, looking at Halloween stuff is for me. Whenever it gets closer to Christmas, that's the way that I am about looking at Christmas stuff too. I'm not as into it as I am with Halloween, but I always just still like looking at the Halloween stuff. But over there is, what did I just, oh, Dollar Tree. There's also, that's where Target is also. And there's like a world market. Okay, dude, you're on the wrong side of the road. Um, and there's some other stuff over there, but for sure I'm gonna go to Target and possibly Dollar Tree. Especially going to Dollar Tree without my husband, because he doesn't like to look around as long as I do, so I can look around a little bit longer. So anyway, that's what I'm up to, and big bump, there's construction going on right here. So if I find out or find anything else cool, you know, I'll show it to you. So I'll talk to you again soon. At Target, they don't have any of their Halloween stuff out in their dollar spot yet. So I'm over here looking at shower curtains right now. I'm looking for something fairly simple. Hey guys, so Target was a bust. <laughs> um, then I went to the Dollar Tree. Didn't get anything there either. They hadn't gotten anything different. Then after the Dollar Tree, I went to World Market. I didn't buy anything there either. I just looked around. And then I went to Pier 1 Imports just for the heck of it. Didn't get anything in there. That place is really expensive. And now I'm going home. <laughs> I mean, I guess it's a kind of day where I didn't spend a bunch of money, so that's pretty good. There's a Tuesday morning over across the street, but I thought about going in there and then I changed my mind because every time I go in that one, I feel like they think I'm gonna steal. It's like people follow you around in there and I can't stand that. Or they're always watching you, you know? I don't like that. So, it's 3.15, I did a lot of walking around, my back actually hurts, and my husband's not going to be home till probably around 5 or so, he said, and then I think we're going to have Panera for dinner. We got a coupon in the mail, and I'm trying to think, I can't think of anywhere else I want to go. So I think I'm just going to go home and relax. And I swear when I was walking around, I was trying to, I had something I was thinking about and now it's just totally escaped me. So anyway, if I think about it when I'm driving home, I'll hop back on. But in the meantime, I am going to say I will talk to you again soon. <laughs> guys 
I'm home. And since I was right there, I did go ahead and stopped at Spirit because they had two things there that I really liked last time we were there and I didn't get them. And then I got an email that had a 20% off, so I went ahead and got them. And so I'll show you what I got. First thing is a pair of socks with it. And they actually had both versions. They had the original version with um, Tim Curry and then this one, but I actually like this version. So I got a pair of socks and I got a sweatshirt. This looks like, um, it's like really soft and vintage feeling, but I really liked the neck, how it's got that crisscross. And it's a jack-o'-lantern, just a long sleeve sweatshirt. And they didn't have a large, they only had an extra large and a small. So I went ahead and got the extra large, but it looks, it doesn't look too big to me. Plus I don't mind sweatshirts being roomy, but I just loved this. I don't know if you can see the material, but I just really liked the neck. So yeah, and they actually hadn't gotten anything else out. I was expecting them to get more of like their animatronics out and have them set up, but there wasn't anything else out. Lots of boxes with stuff, but whatever. So yeah, now I'm home. And I'm going to sit and rest my feet for a bit. But I think I'm going to go ahead and wrap this up because the only other thing that we have plans to do tonight is, like I said, eat. And then tomorrow we're going to go to Oceans of Fine, so, and there's really not anything to show you there. So I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up for the week. And then if over the weekend, if anything big or exciting or interesting does happen, I'll just start the next week's vlog early. So anyway, thanks for spending another week with me. I really appreciate it. And I'll talk to you next week. Bye.